um, it, it, it just seems like, you know, that was a couple seasons ago. But they are coming off a win at, Miss, at Minnesota. Um, that game was an overtime win for them. Um, you know, obviously they're 3-11 they're and 11 in conference. They're one of the people that are kind of lower in the standings right now. And, you know, our team just understands, just like, you know, when we played Rutgers, that it doesn't matter. You know, every game is important and every game counts the same. And I thought I was so happy with the way that we played against Rutgers and the way that we came out um, really focused and, and, you know, kept the intensity the whole game, even with a big lead. And I think sometimes that can be really hard to do. Um, so... Wisconsin coming in, I know my team won't take them lightly. Um, you know, they're, they're a good team in that they're really balanced. I mean, they have five people in double figures. And anytime you have five people in double figures, um, it, it's very hard to guard that team. Um, they have four exceptional offensive rebounders. Um, they've got three-point shooters. Uh, one of the better freshmen in the league and Sarah Williams at the center position. Now, she did get hurt at the six-minute mark in the fourth quarter of the Minnesota game did not come back in that victory. So I don't know what her status will be for the game. It looked like an ankle twist, but you, you just don't know, right? She never came back in that game. Um, so, you know, we're looking forward to playing at home. It's, it's hard to believe that we're winding down, only two home games remaining. Um, you know, that, that's hard to believe, but uh, we'll, we'll be ready for Wisconsin. I don't recall many times in recent years where you guys have dropped one of these head scratching losses, I guess you could call it, if, you know, looking at how teams look on paper. What have you found successful over the years in hammering home that point that, you know, every game needs to be treated the same? Yeah, and I think they're smart and they understand that, you know, like one bad loss takes you out of the picture, you know, so you just don't want to have any of those bad losses. And I, I don't think we've had a bad loss yet this year. Um, you know, you go back and you think a uh, one point at Kansas State, it was early, it was one point, it was on the road. Um, so I, I don't think we've had a bad loss and we want to keep it that way.